friends, I hope you have a beautiful day. I'm Eva and in this video I talk about some very important topics about healthy lifestyle in general. So the first topic that I want to talk about is taking responsibility for your health. Because I really believe that we are taught in our society that we don't have much power over our health. That we, when we get a disease or when we get ill, it's just something that happens. And I agree, there are sometimes certain conditions that can just happen for whatever re reason, genetics, etc. But certainly there are a lot of conditions that we could highly influence. For example, heart attack, stroke, etc. Cancer, all of that is something that we actually can play a role in in minimizing the risk for getting those conditions. So by eating a very healthy lifestyle, by eating a lot of fresh fruit and vegetables, we can highly, highly minimize the risk of getting those conditions. And that is why I think it is so important to take responsibility to say, okay, this is my life, this is my health, I just have this one body, I want to take care of my body. And it does not matter how old you are, it just matters how much you like your body and how much you like yourself. So that you understand that you are valuable, that you have worth, that your health is important and that you can take control over your health. And that is basically my or what i believe is the most important thing if you want to live a healthy lifestyle to have the mindset that you can take a great control over your health and that's basically what i think is so important this topic of responsibility in any area of your life that you take responsibility over your health over your emotions over your communication your finances your um, how you look that you just take responsibilities for those actions that you have. And the next topic that I want to talk about is if I just eat organic and the answer is no, I don't just eat organic. I think it really depends where you live also because back then when I lived in Germany last year, I, I was not eating organic because first it was quite expensive and second, even though it was organic, the quality was not really that much better i mean it depends like i try to buy organic because um sometimes the quality is better but it's it didn't really happen that much what when i try to buy organic it most is when for example i buy i don't know condiments spices or soy sauce or something like that then i try to buy it organic but with fruit and vegetables i just much rather look for quality for example now i live on the canary island and if we compare the quality of the fruit and vegetables to the quality in germany it's just a, like a huge big difference even though the produce on the canary islands might not be organic but i definitely in the future like a dream of mine is that I really want to grow my own food, maybe have um, a garden where I can just grow delicious fruit and vegetables. I think that would be super, super awesome because that's just so amazing, so good for the planet to grow food. And yeah, so that's just something that I'm quite interested in. And another thing that I want to talk about is that it does not really matter um, how many products you have or if you if everything's perfect for example if you want to go raw vegan it does not really matter where you live or um if you ha if you're living in this amazing raw vegan community or you have access to this amazing fruit and vegetables because the truth is that i got to know some people who had everything against them like family was not supportive of them changing their lifestyle they didn't have great access to fresh fruit and vegetables and still they managed to go raw vegan or mostly raw vegan or perfect whatever and then some years later once they had everything once they had access to great fruit they already had built these connections with friends that are also interested into a healthy lifestyle suddenly they stopped eating raw vegan and they went back to cooked food or junk food etc and this really really showed me that the most important asset that you have in making your healthy lifestyle dream come true is really your mindset is 
if you want it bad enough, how much do you want to change your life, how much do you want to be healthier. This is really the most important um, factor in creating a better life for yourself. So I think definitely just start where you are and with time you can really just um, progress. For example, I the first like I'm raw vegan or mostly raw vegan for almost four years now and I never owned a dehydrator and now I'm just buy I I will buy one and I'm going to make just really fancy cool recipes and yeah but the first four years I didn't have one. So it just shows that you don't need all of this stuff, etc. for you to start. Um, yeah, so that's really, really important. And if there's anything else, uh, before I end this video, I also want to say that I'm currently living on the Canary Islands and I really plan to um, now go back to Germany, but then I really want to come back to the Canary Islands because the climate makes such a big difference to me, to my well-being, like just you being in February, you can be on the beach and there's sun and it's just, I, I really truly love it and I really think that I don't want to go back to the winter because it makes everything so difficult and it's not for me. So yeah, but that's just, it just should show you that if something is not working for you, for example, winter, cold winter, and it's, you just, it's just not working for you, you can find a way to make it work for you, maybe spend some time in the, in the tropics or in the Canary Islands um, because you don't have to suffer, you don't have to live a life that you don't enjoy. Um, and before I end this video, the last topic for today is because I get asked on Instagram a lot um, about just my favorite products or which blender I use and all of that. So I created a store with all of my favorite products that I use on a daily basis. And if you're interested in which products I use and also which books have helped me so much to improve my way of thinking, to improve my mindset and to get me to the next level, basically, um, I've written all of it or I just created the store for you that you don't have to search endlessly but that you have all of the products that I use so if you are interested then definitely check out the link in my bio so that you can go to the store and easily find all of my favorite products so yeah that's for today and I hope you have a wonderful day and if you have any questions or anything just write them down in the comment section and I wish you a wonderful time much love and see you in my next video bye bye